How you doing today, guys? Bomber back here again. I'm um, apparently a bit of a farmer right now. <laughs> now, when I say I think I'm a bit of a, a, a farmer, I know I'm a farmer. Oh shit, I need to get out. I'm dropping stuff on the ground here. Okay, turn on fertilizer spread, there we go. Alright, simple thing, very, very, very simple, I'm a bit of a farmer, I have some stuff, um, gonna just, yeah, over here, my farm's over there by the way, if you've seen my first episode of Southern Cross, Farming tomorrow. Oh, that's I've updated, upgraded quite a bit since then. Alright, get up here. We're going to stop here. There, there, be fine. Alright, so, start off with those two sheds over the far side, and that one there. Uh, can't get rid of them, can't sell them. It's fine. And um, two farms, one over there, one over there. Uh, your part, but here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. And one way over there. Uh, I don't now have house. I have a house. I've got a garage. I've got uh, a clothes factory. Yep, got plenty of clothes going in there. We got the wool waiting to go in. I have a shed with bales in it. Jump up. No, oh, can't jump up. Alright, that's fine. We got some hay bales in here. We got some wool bales in here. It's great. It's fantastic. Fantastic. Got a, uh, a cow farm over there. We got two sheds of um, sheep, got black sheep on this side, the white sheep on that side, got to keep them segregated. Uh, yeah, so this is the uh, cow, cow barn, uh, I think I can have, what's the animals, 160, I'm pretty sure I can have about 500 or 1500 animals here, so we've got a long way to go before we are uh, out of full capacity, but we do have chickens down here. Or we have a um, thing here. straw bale. Straw bale's working here. The chickens over here. Now these chickens, we have 5,000 in here. 5,000 chickens. Can't see it because we're not allowed to open up doors. I'm not allowed to open up doors. But this is the uh, this is the eggs. Them on the edge as we get around to them. Okay. Go up or down, let's come that right way around. Okay, there we go. And then we'll throw these ones over there. Okay. Alright, that's fine, that's fine. Put that there down. Yep. Uh, but, uh, uh, we have. Uh, uh, we have a truck out there. That truck is actually holding. There we go. Yeah, it's almost completely full, actually. It is an auto load pallet, truck, trailer, which is exactly what. And that was dumb. Go that way. Not gonna work. Do that. Then. Nope, not working. I don't know. It's very, very finicky trying to find the um, the thing for this. Uh, 
the trigger. Very hard to find the trigger. Very, very hard to find the trigger. That one's done. These ones are going. That one's still not going, even though everything else around it is. Put on the top of the pellets. Go on. Done. Right. We have a bio industrial BGA, which we can uh, put straw, silage, uh, let's see, uh, I'll show you in a bit. Uh, we got a honey factory here, okay, it's good going, plenty of honey going. Alright, uh, so we have some vehicles. Uh, this is my Lizard Colossus. Sorry. This is a Colossus 9000 flat map condition. It goes fast. I don't want to go that way, I want to go this way. Because I have surprises the other way. This is my John Deere 7R350. He is purely there for lime. Lime spreaders. Oh, we've got this guy here. Let's lower his plow. Let's get him actually working. Everybody plows. All the time plows. All the time plows. He's going to miss some that way, he might miss some that way. It's fine. It's. I'll work him out. Uh, that one. There, there we go. We got a cotton. A cotton one. That's how we got all that stuff before. Uh, we have a lizard road runner. With a trailer on the back. He does a fair bit of stuff. This guy here just sits in here dumping. There we go. Dumping TMR. TMR is cheap as hell. Uh, I'll just prove it to you. Uh, this trailer, by the way, this trailer is a tight trailer. It's a Titan trailer, which can hold unrealistically, unrealistically, half a million litres of whatever I ask. And I'll just put that out of the way. There we go. And if I do start filling, um, it's going to be, let's say, 250,000 thereabouts uh, TMR. Which won't take much. Ultra cheap. Ultra cheap. I've got half a million in here. So it's no big deal. No big deal at all. Come on. Finish it off. Finish it off. Just so we can show the people how much it costs, really, for TMR. As opposed to actually buying something to make it. Here we are, here we are, here we are, here we are. There we go. $22,000 that cost me. Get 250,000 litres of TMR. I mean, you can't beat that. Cannot. You try to beat that. You're never going to be able to beat that. I'm going to try and get through the gate. Yep, there we go. Uh, we have a ship over there with the um, with the grass, the hay. Bam. There we go. Back in here, we just go over here. This guy here is our um, straw bale. Just usually pick it up or give it a bit of a throw or whatever. Uh, 200,000 litres is as much as we're going to do anyway. So not really going to do much, but yeah, you know, just move around here in this general area. I have some spares in here for that reason. Uh, 
be up and into the truck. Another Lizard Road Runner. Um, there you go, 425,000 litres of slurry right now. Uh, that there is actually my, um, oh, what do you call it, the, the, the shoot cane harvester, shoot cane harvester, with another, another Titan on the back, so it's half a million litres of, uh, of stuff on the back, and it dumps directly into it, absolutely brilliant, perfect bloody thing. This is my tree killer. Um, he's simply here at the moment. Whenever I buy a new field, and I need to go and um, get rid of some trees. That's what he. That's what he. He, he is here for. Otherwise, I'm just doing this basically. Just moving between the two, just to fill stuff up. Uh, that's my uh, harvester. Uh, beet or potato harvester. That's my mower. Uh, that's his fruit, uh, his area out there. And we're back to this guy again. Back to this guy again. Oh no, we're going to go this way now. We go the other way. That one. That one. That one. And then ah, oh, there we go. The truck. Okay, so H magnet. Payo drive, twin turbo, awesome looking machine right there. And this here is what I wanted to hide you from. I have some monster trucks. I made a couple of million, and three and a half million. I spent most of it on vehicles. This is one of them. This is the second one. That's a third one. That's another one. The Lincoln. Nice little hot rodded little GT. Ah, I have to say. I love them all. I really do. Um, honestly, don't get past the bus. A party bus especially. It's a lot of bus. Ah, another one, Boston. Love Boston. <laughs> uh, then I bought a few of these quads. Quads can, um, I've got them set up around the area that I want to fast travel to. So I can keep an eye on the bales that I've got here. Another one here, or as you've seen earlier, for the eggs. And then we're back here to these guys. He's finished, has he? Alright, that's fine. Let's um, lower the plow. Oh, he's made a bit of a mess of it. Mess of it. That's fine. That's what he's here for. He is here for a simple, simple reason. And that is to plow. That's all. I can do the rest. I do have a second plow. I just need to get him past this point so I can put him on. Um, auto drive once I've got him past this point I think I might I can see one goes this way the other one goes that way so I'm not going that way there alright all right, you do that for a bit alright I'll show you my um, I'll just quickly show you my um, farms all right so we have number 20 number 20 is my grass field that one number one is actually my um what do you call it uh sugarcane field sugarcane field uh 14 and 15 as you've seen of mate he's plowing it up right now um seven two and three which are they are actually three separate fields but I've um, moved them up into becoming oat there you go oat uh, 12 16 11 15 and 10 I've turned into wheat Let's put oat back on. 
yeah, so those guys, um, they're my big, them big money makers right there. These two, I can make millions in one crop, one crop alone. These three here are simply just persistent gules. That one there is my grass field. Whenever I feel like making some more grass, I do. This one here, it, I mean, it makes me a bit of money. This one here is a, mo uh, a large amount of money, but these two here are the big ones. But I also own these here too. That's what I want to show you. We're going to jump in. This guy I do. Yeah, this guy I do. Let's open that up. Let's try and jump in Havoc. This is uh, something I've been thinking about for a while. And that is... Oh! Look out, sunshine! Way too quick! Way too quick! <laughs> I can barely turn. That's how quick he is. Uh, uh, nope. Definitely, definitely going to be a lot of fun. Let's um change his L3 there. Front wheel steering. There we go. I'll be a little bit easier to control now. But um, over here. This one. There we go. There we go. See that field there? Is that field there? Plus all of this field over here and the water and circle around, circle around, circle around. You can't sell these shit, by the way. They stay on the field forever. This is why I want to do it. This is why I want to do it. So we have a river here. And then through here, just here, is the rest of my field. This is my field. Right here. All the way through here. Plus over there. So what I'm thinking is making some jumps. Alright. Make some jumps that actually clear this area. Get rid of these trees. Making a track for my monster trucks. And trucks in general. And 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 harvesters in general. What I want to do is actually make a track that goes over this, passes over the top of this, comes back over here around about comes back over here, does a bit of a circle out this way, or it comes back that way, and then you come out here with a long and winding turn back out this way, and then you shoot back over that way. You have to make the jump. Anything, this is what I like, this is what, anything that ends up in the water, stays in the water. What do you reckon? What do you reckon? This could be cool. So, if one of the monster trucks or a truck or whatever lands in the water, it stays in the water. I don't bring it back out. It stays there. It also becomes it becomes a bit of a um a hazard. And then we go around here, and then we go around here, then we go. And then we go, oh, 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 nice little straight away, straight away, straight away. Then we go, big old turn here. Oh, and then we go, big old straight away around the other side of this guy. Right, we have jumps here, jumps and jumps and jumps and jumps. Do, 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 do. Through jumps. And then we're going to go through a, a big um, a burn here. 
and then we go through here again. Nice big long straight. Banana jumps and jumps and jumps and jumps. Then we go to another bird. Then straight away. Then we get a bit of um, what do you call it? Uh, a bit of speed up. If we hit this one here too fast, we end up hitting the silo up there. But if we hit too slow, we drown. That's right. That's right. Anything, anything that lands in there stays there. I've got money. I've got money at the wazoo. I've got 1.5 mil. And I've got everything I ever, ever wanted. So, yeah. What do you reckon, guys? This could be fun. This could be a lot of fun. Uh, yeah, this one. Yeah, yeah. Now, um, I know what you're thinking. That water is probably fake. So. Boom. There it is. Havoc is now stuck there, but like I said, it's not time for that one yet, so we need to pull him out. Uh, where are we then? That one, Havoc. Let's reset Havoc. Oh dear. Oh, get rid of this uh, backwards thingy. Uh, there. Helper right there. All right. Now there are two of these monster trucks that just take off at a hundred million miles an hour as soon as we ask them to go. This is one of them. So there is another one. And I will not show you that one until I've got the. Um... <laughs> yes! Way to flip over, boy. So, I don't have it. I won't show you it until uh, I've got the track ready to go because I can see some of these track trucks going absolute schizo. Absolutely schizo. But uh, look, if you enjoy the video that I've just put out, like I said, I'm still maintaining my farm. But I'm gonna have a bit, of, a bit of fun out there. That's that's what I reckon. If you enjoyed this video, if you want to see some more, uh, if you want to see my vehicles going silly buggers. Now, when I say trucks and stuff, I have done a few fair few downloads uh, these guys here are going to be part of the fun uh, let's see yeah he's going to be part of the fun yeah of course of course he's going to be part of the fun of course all these vehicles are going to be part of the fun he is yes I just said that he is probably with a trailer on the back he's going to be part of the fun this I don't think is really going to do too well because like his top speed's only 22 but I reckon he can be able to get around the um <laughs> I reckon he'll be able to get around the uh <laughs> the track without a problem <laughs> he's pretty good at turning just not very fast <laughs> But he is going to be part of the fun. This guy here, going to be part of the fun. He's got 89 kph. He's going to be part of the fun. That 43, he's in. They're all in. Every single one of them are in. The only thing I won't be doing is taking full loads of this of me, uh, TMR. Now, this full TMR at, a, at half a million litres of TMR although it doesn't cost much it still costs me like 
$700,000 to, to fill. That's a lot of money to just throw away. So I'm not going to be taking in any full loads. Okay. But. <sighs> but I will be enjoying myself. I can tell you that much. Okay, you're doing that. Yep. And, like I said, I'm going to go into here. Here we are, vehicles, 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 cars, there we are. So we've got all of these ones to choose from. I will be bringing these, all of these, into the game as I can afford them, as I want to actually buy them. You've seen all these ones. I haven't got that one yet. I haven't got the thunder yet. But, you know. I do have quite a few of them. I've got all the small tractors. I've got all the medium tractors. I've got a lot of large tractors. I've got a few trucks. Oh, harvesters. I've got quite a few harvesters. Some forage harvesters, some potato technology, oh, uh, just beet technology, sugarcane, no, nah. cotton, you've seen my cotton, haven't done any grape yet, uh oh, but they're going to be in there too, hey, some forestry machinery, oh mate, down in India, and you got these guys. When I've got the money, they're coming in too. I do have, what What have I got? 1670 of 4,400 total slots for vehicles and whatnot. So, once something has, once something has um, died in the arse, basically, and I need room, then, uh, sorry, I'm just showing you what I've got here, then uh, I will, I will get rid of it, and download something else if you like it. If you ask me for it, just tell me. Tell me what you think I should download, and I'll download those ones, but I will not be getting rid of any of my actual machines, such as, and, 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 or, or and this on the other hand though I could be persuaded to get rid of these ones if you're wondering how fast this goes this is 45 kph it's going to cruise around the house a little bit there you go it's not very very fast but very maneuverable very maneuverable all right we got to pop you popping back away now and just once once it in just quickly take you for a quick tour again of the house so i've got the house here with my two cars in here i've got this thing here this is actually, um, it keeps my um, satellite thing going. This is a house here. I do like these houses. I do like walk through houses where I can actually go up it, um, and move stuff. It says turn on satellites. So you turn it on, turn it off, turn it on. So you put the house lights on. 
come up in here. It is. I, I, I do like these sort of houses. Those other sort of houses where you stand on the outside, you look inside, and it looks like this, but it's not actually like this. I don't like those. I don't like those houses. But this is the house. Oh, yeah. Sorry, dude. Uh, yeah. Uh, so, houses here. Uh, clothes. Actually, uh, all I'm going to do is put in. This is not one of those ones where you got to put linen into it. You put in the wool or the cotton and clothes come out the ass. So, don't have to worry about that. It. It's at one quarter, I think it is. So, let's just say 4,000 litres of wool you get 1,000 litres of clothes. So it takes a little while, that's why that one is still sitting there. I have actually emptied that once. I've also emptied the eggs thrice. I've also emptied the uh, honey once. So, uh, and the milk, on the other hand, milk has been emptied twice. Milk has been emptied twice, honey once, uh, the eggs thrice, uh, once for the clothes, yeah, yeah, that's pretty much it. <sighs> right, so like I said, if you enjoy these videos, if you enjoy, if you're thinking what I'm doing might be a little bit of fun to watch. Throw a like on there. Subscribe if you need to. If you haven't already. If you have. Hey. I appreciate you. If you haven't. And you're thinking about it. I appreciate you too. But I appreciate you better if you subscribed. <laughs> yeah, just coming through. Just showing you my... Um, my sheds, these one, two, and three over there. These three here, can't get rid of them. They are my forever sheds. This one here, just put it in. Only just recently, that one over there, same, same. And that one there, can't get rid of. And these two here, I've put in, same, same. So yeah, anyway, if you enjoy the video, like I said, Show your support with a bit of a, uh, a thumbs up. Comment. For God's sake, comment. Tell me what I am and not doing wrong. I'll take anything. Any sort of uh, comments. I'll I look at every single one when they come in. And... Uh, Sorry, I'm having a hard time trying to find the plug to plug this thing back in again. Right. Yeah. Right. yeah, um I do have greenhouses over there, you probably see them over there. Uh all my comments uh I try to at least like them, give them a bit of a heart, or even um uh, talk back uh, so good day and that sort of stuff you know I try to do all that sort of stuff <laughs> I farted <laughs> I didn't really no no, no it wasn't me <laughs> uh, that's my workshop by the way if you haven't seen it workshop there I've got um, a silo over there that just fills uh, which you see me doing with the um, TMR and yeah, it's just, just a whole bunch of areas here. I'm on hard, by the way. This is this is hard difficulty. I can actually show you by going, no. I want this one here. Oh, there you go, saving. Right. Let's go into 
the help window. No, that's not it. There it is. So auto save. I've got the time scale three. Economic difficulty hard. Tra uh, traffic off seasons no. One day a month. There you go. Um, then we go into these ones here. There you go. <laughs> Honestly, pause if you need to. <laughs> I ain't going through all the crap. I ain't going through all that crap. No way in the world. But uh, you did see at the very start there. Uh, my economic is on difficult, hard, difficulty is on hard, so, um, yeah, I ain't doing this stuff easy, it's taking a long time to get to this stuff, at least three weeks, three actual weeks, but, um, jump into there, no, no, jump, there we go, there is some gates you can close here, which is kind of cool, no, that there, not there, Oh, there, there it is, there it is. You can close these gates so it makes it look like the um, the cows are walking between the open field and the uh, shed. But it looks like, I mean, it helps me be able to get through here. Oh, by the way, these, these trees here, one, two, three trees, uh, four trees, five. Every single tree you see up here, Every single one, original trees. I built my stuff around these trees. I use the um, uh, build button thingy where oh, I can't even remember how you do it now. Uh, let's see if I can do this one. Okay, so construction. Uh, let's just go with building sheds. There it is. Let's go with that. Uh, nope. Uh, there. Right. So see it says overlaps with object. If I hit the triangle button, this is what it's gonna cost me. I can put it wherever I like. But you wanna make sure that your area is level before you do so. So, uh, let's go again. There we go. so we can actually see what, what I've got here. There you go. There you go. Uh, zoom out, zoom in. There we go, there we go, there we go. See. Yeah, so this is the what I've got. This is the area that I've got. I've got um if I move down here, I've got this this one here. Over here we got this guy here, across the highway we got these guys. For miles. Back up our driveway there. we I've actually cut this one down short. As you can see there, I want to make it nice and straight. As close as I can, you've got the driveway there. Get up here, this is how much of the field there should have been, all the way through here. Got rid of it, want it straight, want it straight, want it straight. And then we've got, like I said, over here, that's my grass field, but over here, this is where the fun is going to be. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, this should pro actually probably be the start. And I get bored. Then we go back this way. Then we go back like that. Then we go over this way. Right here. Should I finish it there? We'll sort of go around here and then around here and then go around and then the finish. I don't know. I'm thinking that might be a better idea. But um, anyway, let me know what your thoughts. See you later. Bye for now.